be. And this video is going to be October's vlog. And it's nighttime, as you may be able to tell by the, I don't know, windows or the lighting. But I thought I would just start the vlog here because I'm starting to get a sore throat. And I don't know if it will get to a point where I sound kind of bad or it's hard to talk, you know. But anyway, the next clips you are going to see after this intro are from this event. It's a really fun event that I've been going to for the past like six years, every fall. But anyway, the corn maze thing, it's like a corn maze. It starts at 5.30 and we usually don't leave around 10. So it's really fun. We usually go in the corn maze once while it's light. You can go in the corn maze when it's dark, which is super fun which you normally don't get to do at really any other places because corn mazes close before it gets dark. So anyway, the next clips after this will be from that. Hopefully I'll be able to vlog with this thing and hopefully it will turn out well and I won't shy out from doing it. But right now I was just gonna watch probably some Dance Moms because there's really nothing else to watch. So I guess I'll just show you a couple things. Um, the bunnies are digging on some hay over there. Um, my room, somewhat messy. In there, Stormy. I don't get it. He, like, goes by the door and he sticks his, like, nose through right here, even though it's open right there. Like, he can just go through. But I put some hay in a box, which is probably pretty dumb, because they're just gonna dump it over and... Oh, Misty, you're so lazy. But anyway, enjoy these fun clips from the Night Maze. And also, I forgot to talk about, I just thought of that. Um, I'm meeting up with an online friend that I've never met before. So I'm really excited about that as well. But anyway, enjoy the next whatever of this video. Um, this may be the last part of this part of the vlog tonight. Right? Right. Okay. Um, but anyway, it's like probably 35 what? degrees out. It's what? freezing. So, yeah, we're just gonna follow the left rule. It's gonna be boring. Um, see how it takes oh, us. I need to turn this flashlight back on because it's better than the one that Sarah's using. Say okay, bye. You will have to save me. What day is it? October 17th. Oh. It's Christmas! It's snowing! It's October 26th. Oh. Look at that, that's pretty. I am so excited. Look at this thing. It's big and beautiful. And let's open it. So a lot of people may ask where I got this and such. Oh, there's a tab. Um, this is brand new. As you can see, this tab isn't sealed. The bottom isn't opened. Brand new. And I got a very good deal. I saw a listing pop up on eBay. And it was for $1,050. And I went for it. Because that saved me like $300 for this. I'm going to keep all the packaging for reasons. <laughs> How does this come off? Oh, here's the keyboard. Here's the power. So yeah, styrofoam is being smooth. 
I did get a little cover for the keyboard. It's so beautiful. And so many wrapping things. I think this is like the perfect size for me because it's 27 inch is huge. I've been in Best Buy and stuff and it wouldn't fit on my desk. I think this is the perfect size for my desk and for me. Because I wouldn't want my I don't I don't think I'd like a huge screen maybe. And I have to I'm gonna set up set this set it up on my desk and then I'll turn it on and stuff. I don't wanna use the magic mouse. I want to use my mouse for now. I don't really know if I like the mouse, magic mouse. I like my mouse. Use English because I speak English, I think. United States, US. Oh, don't show the Wi Fi name. Connect onto Wi Fi. What if you didn't have Wi Fi? Like, like how would I be able to get one when like I didn't have Wi Fi? Like, how would you do it? You'd have to bring this to where there was Wi Fi to turn it on. <laughs> That would be awful. I really want to protect this from like crumbs and stuff because like keyboards get ruined. I really like the keyboard though. Oh, we forgot to look at this stuff. My hand actually says howdy right now. <laughs> it says hello, startup guide, who needs that? Um, I'll keep all of these. Yeah, I got more stickers. Oh, and here are the bunnies. Hello bunnies. They're like, eh, we don't care. We don't care about your new computer. No, we don't. Hey guys, so these next clips you're gonna see are a little bit of gymnastics stuff because a lot of you have been asking to see an update and I thought I would show an update before snow's on the ground and I can't really do it till spring which is kind of sad because um, to stay strong I'm just gonna have to do boring stuff like workout type stuff all winter to stay strong which is gonna be annoying but I hope you enjoy these few clips. So as you can see, there's snow on the ground. That's how cold it is. But anyway, I'm just going to show you some stuff. do a handstand or walk on my hands like it was just not working for me yesterday now it's time to talk about the big update stuff that um, you probably all clicked on this video being like what so on this title you saw in fact that there was moving in the title and yes I am moving so I thought it's about time I talked about this because I really just wanna let you guys know and yeah, this has just been kind of bugging me for a while. So a little bit of backstory here. Our house has been off and on the market for the past year or a little bit more than a year. Because we were like, are we going to sell it? Do we want to move? Yada, yada, yada up in the air. But a couple months ago, some people from Wisconsin came and they indeed bought our house. So our house is over and done with. It is bought. The, the people own it. It is no longer ours. The sale is completely done with for this house. So, we are allowed to stay here till spring if we wanted to because these people have been really, really nice to us. But we indeed found a house and we are now under contract with that house and we will be moving around the... And we will be moving to that house in four weeks from today pretty much. So we'll be all packed up, driving to the house in like exactly four weeks. Like this time in four weeks, we'll probably be on our way, which is really close. The closing's in like three and a half weeks, and we have to pack up everything in the next like three weeks. So I'm probably gonna get somewhat busy, not really though, because 
I mean, it's going to get a little bit hectic, but I don't think it will be that bad. I mean, I just have to pack up my own stuff and kind of help out with um, watching little siblings and things like that. I haven't done a big move like this for nine years, so to move like this is kind of new to me because nine years ago I was only six and I remember it, but I mean, I d we didn't have that many animals then, so it wasn't a big deal. This has been going on for quite a long time, as I said. And I just didn't want to tell you guys till it was getting closer because I didn't want to say that our house was on the market or anything because, I mean, that doesn't really mean much. And I'm not going to tell you quite where we're moving yet. I probably will tell you. Um, who knows? You guys have no clue. It could be Vermont. It could be another state. You don't know. And I'm not going to really tell anybody till... Um, we probably move there just in case it doesn't work out for some reason, but I'm sure it will. This house will probably work out. I know some people may be wondering if I want to move, and yes, I do want to move. I've wanted to move for quite a while. There's really not much around. I mean, I like it around here. I have lived in this town for the past eight years. So now I am planning on doing like a moving vlog or two because I think moving all the animals and everything is gonna be quite an event to just bring, let's see, to bring three goats, the dogs, the chickens, the duck, the bunnies, the hamster, I mean, <laughs> to see it all work out to bring all of them is gonna be interesting, so I'll definitely vlog with the bunnies. I am working out with like what I'm gonna do with the bunnies when we first get there and stuff. But anyway, those are all the long boring updates. So these next couple weeks might be a little bit hectic and I don't know if I'll be able to get all the videos out but I'll definitely be doing. I think moving vlogs would be fun because it might be the only thing to film while everything's kind of packed up. But anyway guys. I really hope you have enjoyed this video. This is now the end of the vlog. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, remember to leave a like. Leave a comment down below with ideas. I mean, I want to tell you the setup that I'm going to do, but I also want it to be a surprise. I don't really quite know yet because I kind of want help with a couple things that I don't know how I'm going to do. But anyway, I really hope you have enjoyed this video. If you did, remember to leave a like. And anyway guys, thanks for watching and I'll be seeing you in my next video. Bye!